Hello and welcome to another What's Inside. This time we are looking at Deer Pong. This is a game of skill from Hasbro Games of 2020. Two plus players, ages eight and up. Does require three triple, I'm sorry, three double A batteries to play. And some adult assembly. That's a family friendly talking deer game featuring Bucky the Stag. Now, those who consume adult beverages in college may recognize this as beer pong with a twist. So we've got a talking deer here with antlers and cups that, to catch the ball. So you got three different uh, cups for each side. So let's open this up and see what we've got. The box feels kind of cheap and it's just held shut with a couple of stickers or pieces of tape. So let's open it up and see what the contents look like. First up, we have our instruction sheet here. Contents are a deer head, the backboard, stand, four antlers, uh, pieces, four antler pieces rather, six cups and eight balls. Very colorful, I like that. Paper quality's not too bad. It got a little banged up in the box. But you can see it's easy to assemble, there's not a lot to it. And the batteries go in the back. You will need a screwdriver from the look of it. But we'll see that more in a minute. Now the cups are just little things. They are kind of specific to the game though because they do have this kind of like lip here. And it's got a little indention on it. So where it hooks into the antlers, I assume. I guess it goes like that. Some, something like that. Right, as far as the antlers go, these two pieces look like they're the bigger ones. Uh, they're very specific to the game. And they appear to be different. So, yeah, you're going to have to make sure everything is there. This is pretty decent plastic, so that's a good sign. I don't know what this is. I think it's just random piece of cardboard all right here's our deer head let's figure out how this opens well, that's a giant plastic bag for this thing all right, so this says deer pong on top of the hat, It's kind of cool. Mouth moves, obviously, and it looks like uh, it's one of those universal screws that you can use a, either a Phillips or a standard. So pretty neat. Uh, it's a little heavy. Probably don't want the kids playing with that. So it doesn't say how to turn it on and off. I assume once it has batteries in it, it just kind of self-activates. So let's take a look at our other pieces here. These are actually a little larger than ping pong balls. It's the type of stuff you'd get in a cereal box in the 80s, but it'd glow in the dark and look like a moon. So a little bit bigger than ping pong balls. Uh, you could probably replace it with ping pong balls if you had to, but these actually have nice 
easy weight to them, but they probably will break if they hit something hard. And they fit really nicely in these cups too, so that's kind of neat. So we've got eight of those. Here is our stand or part of it. You can see on the side it's got a picture of a ball there, so the ball should let go here. Here's our other two antlers. Specific design and molding, but these are a lot smaller. And here's our backboard. So this sits in here, I think. I saw that picture right. Yeah, it just kind of sits there. And then the head goes on here. And it kind of clicks into place like that. So the antlers attach on the head, obviously, and seem to interconnect onto these other ones. And you could put a couple of these on there. All right, uh, the components are pretty decent quality, actually. I'm a little impressed. This is a little cheap, but it's not as bad as I thought it would be. Uh, it actually doesn't look all that bad. This piece is kind of heavy. This could hurt somebody if they got hit with it, so be aware of that. But yeah, overall, these are pretty decent... Decent quality components. These are pretty nicely made. The balls are a little cheap, but they kind of have to be because they need to be able to bounce quite a lot. And the horns are pretty decent. Okay, that is what is inside the 2020 Deer Pong game from Hasbro. Featuring a talking deer head, six cups, eight balls, and uh, uh, hours of fun. Aim to ages 8 and up, 2 or more players. Like I said, you do need 3 AA batteries. But it, the components are actually pretty good quality. It's kind of surprising considering, you know, that it, a lot of the other games we look at like this are fairly cheaply made. But it looks like it's pretty decent stuff. So, yeah, definitely check it out if you're into games of skill where you have to bounce ping pong balls. This might be good for adults. It might be very challenging after some adult beverages. But we've seen what's inside. You've heard my take on it. That's going to do it for this one. Thank you so much for listening and supporting the channel. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button. And don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss future unboxings and reviews. If you'd like to help the channel out in other ways, you could buy yourself something nice from the Teespring store. Send me a donation through PayPal on Streamlabs. Or support me monthly on Patreon. All the links are in the description, and as always, we hope to see you on the next one.